Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Fanika and this is Fanika TV. So today I'm going to be making breadfruit punch. Yes, and it's not it's not an expensive it's not expensive. You know, you'd only need at least you will only need you don't need a lot of ingredients. So yeah, today um all we need is quarter of breadfruit um slightly turn you need your evaporated milk your condensed milk your nutmeg your rare neighbor rum and the, the, the rum it is optional depending so if you don't want to put rum in it you don't have to put rum in it you can use red label wine if you want to you don't have to put the um the white rum in it and vanilla just to give it a nice little flavor and a nice little taste and of course nutmeg so yeah so yeah guys yeah go cut yeah go cut the breadfruit in a segments Then peel off the skin. Peel off the skin. And take out the art. Make sure you remember to take out the art. Right? And then you have to cut it in a small pieces. Remember guys, if you are not already subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so that you get notified when I post another video and share the video to family and friends guys don't be selfish share the video so you cut it in cubes Cut it in cubes. So yeah, this is the last piece. Cut off the skin. So yeah, guys, all you need is like a slightly ripe breadfruit. I don't know what type of breadfruit this is, and I just want to say Happy Independence Day to all the Jamaicans. Yeah. Because everybody know that a lot of breadfruit are roasted. But me not eat. I don't eat roast breadfruit. So I'm trying to make a different, you know, different. So the art, throw it away. Cut it in small cubes, right? Small cubes. <coughs> You can cut them smaller and cut them because we're going to mash them out. Yes, guys. This showing you guys how to make breadfruit. Once we don't. Yeah. You see how much breadfruit we get, guys? So, quarter, quarter for all the breadfruit is enough to make breadfruit pudding. Guys, I'm going to catch the fire. It's hot. Fire already, you know, this already. Hot, guys. Oh, 
Hey guys, we get something now. I'm gonna find the fire wheel. I'm gonna find the fire wheel this bus. Most like fire, they don't like button. I'm already gonna have fire in it. So, I'm trying to get it. Yeah, guys um the fire ketchup and everything we're going to be putting two cups of water in a in a pot right look at one more water i'm gonna put one more i'm gonna put more water so, yeah. so we're gonna need like four cups of water because the two cup is small and then you work we go we go add it on the fire so yeah and then what we're going to do next guys we're going to add our breadfruits Go we'll wash the bread fruit then first. Make sure so you wash the bread fruit then. Yes, guys, wash the bread fruits. And then put them in nine pot. Guys, we're we'll gonna make them cook. Boil, 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 boil. Yes, guys. So remember to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so that you get notified every time I post another video because I plan on being consistent this time so yeah so you add all of the bread food pieces you mix them make sure say but it is done for it alright now we're going to make it boil up all right, guys, we're going to add some salt to the pot. Add some salt. I'm sorry, you know, stop boiling up yet, but add some salt. Yes, guys, the pot is bubbling. It is bubbling. So, um, we're going to make it boil up and cook and everything. And stir it up. Please don't turn over. Hey guys, we're gonna make our breadfruit cook and then we're gonna show you all we use it and make the punch. So, yeah, let's go. And remember, guys, to like, like the video, share the video to a family or a friend, share it to your WhatsApp status, share the video to your TikTok, your Instagram. Just, you know, support a new YouTuber, share it to your favorite YouTuber, you know, just share up the video. Also, 
subscribe if you're not already subscribed you know support me and also like the video like um oh no not like the video sorry um also hit that post notification bell so that you get notified when i post another video and also comment guys yes comment right what you want to feel like i should have i should have done or if you guys ever try if you ever try making bread food punch you know and if you do try it like what is this what are the things that you use to make it and so forth so yeah your your opinion it matters so please don't be afraid to comment you know and just support a new upcoming youtuber so thank you okay guys after our breadfruit boil we're gonna take it out see that boil and soft you have to make sure you say boil and soft guys this is what we're going to be doing we're gonna take it out and put it in our dish Portland cool breeze. Hey guys, make sure you say your bread food cook. Don't throw away the water, guys, because you're going to be needing the water with it. We're boiling up. Just want to. yeah guys after we do that so i like breadfruit i like the breadfruit guys i'm going to use a potato masher mash up mash up the breadfruit you're going to do it do it when it hot i'm going to do it guys when it hot guys because when it cool it's going to add a few mash up So it will mash out. Well mash out guys. This is what you're gonna do next. We're gonna add some of the we're gonna add some of the water we're boiling up in it, right? Have some of the, some of the bread food still in it. Still have bread food left. And we now waste nothing, as you know, we Jamaicans, we now waste nothing, and I will eat a bit of food still in this thing. Okay. I continue to mash it up. Hey guys, and be careful when you're doing this, guys, because the water is really, it's really hot. So you see, guys? Want to not see it? Well, my short. Yeah. Well, my short. So, yeah. <laughs> now, guys, I'm going to be adding my surge evaporated milk. You can use any milk, guys, if you're lactose intolerant. You can use any milk. But today I'm going to be using Surge. Surge milk. So, yeah, guys, I'm be careful when I cut it. Add the milk. Ooh. 
and this drink is it is good for everybody in the family as i said the rum is optional you don't have to use the rum tonight Mix your own. To the seat. Ooh, guys, this really smells nice. I'm gonna mix it up until the breadfruit and the some combine together. Smells really good. So you mix, mix until smooth. Oof. Hey guys, see you still here? You say still? Yeah. It's very filling. And it smells really good too. Smell really, really good. Alright, next thing we're going to add is some vanilla. Yeah, we're gonna add some vanilla in it. Bring up the tears. And then mix it. Mix the vanilla, guys. Mm. This smells really good. It smells good. And it looks really good, too. It smells really good. Okay, guys. Okay. Hey guys, I'm going to be adding my condensed milk. Okay, now like, oh my god, I can't make it more. Condensed milk, guys, yeah. Nice condensed milk. You put the condensed milk, guys. You don't really need sugar. You don't really need sugar because you already have the condensed milk in it. And after this, this doesn't need no water. You don't need no water because it's very thick. But if you don't want it, so if if you want like a, a smoother blend, guys, you can blend it up. But I choose not to bend it because I'm trying to make my my dish as natural as possible. So and now guys going to be adding some Ray and Neville. Yeah. Some rum. This drink is. Let me mix it. Yeah. Not like more of the water, I find. Breadfruit water. The 
sweet and a smoothie or little more a mix guys so it smells really good you can't wait to taste it so it smells really good So yes guys, um, we have come to the end of the video, you know, want to see it, yes. so guys, this is the end product, yeah, breadfruit punch, um, I'm going to put it in my, in the, that the video is not it we're not done it i'm going to show you how me put it in a me someday so yeah guys we are going to wash out the wash out the condensed from add add it in just to make it a little more smoother and then mix it and it smell re it smell really really good guys remember if you try this at home please you know you can tag me on my social media handle. You can also say when you drink this, your belly full. Yeah, <laughs> when I drink this. Yeah, hungry at all. When I drink this. It's really, you see there, in a sotic no. But they still have like little chunks. As I said, if you want a smoother, you know, if you want a little smoother, you can blend it. But I choose not to blend it today because I'm trying to make my video as natural as possible. I'm going to throw it in a this. I'm going to throw it in a this. In a this and put to cool in the fridge. So, yeah. Yeah, so much I may get guys with like quarter quarter of the so you know this is a good dish mm -hmm. so, yeah. so yeah guys I will put it for cool And that is the end of the video, guys. Remember to follow me on all social, me social media handles. At fan, um, on Instagram, my name is Fanika TV, and on TikTok, my name is Fanika LKG. And remember to subscribe to my channel. Yes, I'm going to put this to cool, guys. And then I'm going to do a tasting, but I feel like I'm going to do the tasting on my TikTok video. So you can, on my TikTok page, so you can go and follow my TikTok page. Bye guys and have a productive day. And also, you know, um, today, we're, um, today is August 6th and we are celebrating Independence Day. Jamaica is 61 years old. Yeah, so, um, and we have come from afar, you know, we have come really far in celebrating our culture and support. So, you know, peace out, guys. Have a great rest of the year. You know, be safe and, you know, um, any little dream that you have, work on it, no matter how small it is, work on it because, you know, it's your dream. Bye.